World number one Novak Djokovic has endured the most tumultuous period of his career in recent months but remains stronger than ever. The Serb has faced widespread criticism for raising opposition to the Covid vaccine, but former world number two Alex Karecha has praised his peer for being consistent in his principles. The ongoing global pandemic has transformed the tennis landscape, whereby athletes are effectively expected to be fully vaccinated in order to guarantee their rights to compete. Djokovic, 34, has long been outspoken against the jab and said he's willing to miss tournaments in order to, as he sees it, protect his freedom and autonomy. The veteran was deported from Melbourne and prevented from defending his Australian Open title in January before a disappointing quarter-final exit against Yuri Vesely at the Dubai Tennis Championships the following month. It's understood he's set to feature in only his second tournament of 2022 so far at the Monte Carlo Masters, which get underway on April 10. But while the overwhelming majority of top tour players have received the vaccination, Karecha piled praise on the 20-time Grand Slam winner for his defiance. Djokovic won three majors in a calendar year for the third time in his career in 2021, a sign he's far from ready to give up his status as the best men's player on the planet. I think that today, with everything that has happened to him in recent years, since the US Open 2020, the final he lost last year, this year in Australia, he is stronger than ever, said Eurosport commentator Karecha, as quoted by Serb outlet Telegraph.rs. I admire him deeply, because he says what he feels, added the Spaniard. He's not saying the right things to make people love him. You can agree with his way of thinking to a lesser or higher degree, but you cannot criticize him for being consistent in his principles. Djokovic's absence from the Australian Open was a double blow in that it helped Rafael Nadal move clear in the all-time Grand Slam race with a 21st career major. The next chance to draw level with his old rival will come at Roland Garros in May, but Nadal is the 13-time record-holding champion in Paris while Noel won there for only the second time last year. It's been speculated Djokovic may still require vaccination to defend his French Open crown, though eased restrictions mean he may be clear to participate without being jabbed. Regardless of his on-court accomplishments, however, two-time French Open finalist Karecha believes he's already claimed a significant moral victory.